we roll and dole and gotta put the wall and wall and <laughs> gotta put the wall and wall and fruit juice cocktail bro i'm drunk as hell now hey everyone welcome back to another video where today we're gonna be playing some more some nautica all right let's get back into it all right last episode we got pretty much the essentials going and so we got the sea glide we got the repair tool, we got the scanner tool, we got a knife, we got s some upgraded stuff. Yeah, like this stuff. Uh, high capacity O2 tank and the fins and sh stuff like that. And so that's basically just a recap of what happened. Now, last episode, we also got the radio call and we're going deep down over there. That's 500 meters and it's 100 meters down. So this is going to be very interesting because... Whoa. Anyway, I do not like the water. I don't like how deep it goes. And, like, it go I can go past a certain barrier. I don't know what else is, like, down here. Is there supposed to be something here? Oh! Hello? Ow! What the? What the fuck? I've explored that, and it's literally nothing special because there's nothing in it. Now, I don't even know what I want to go for this episode, to be honest. I guess, actually, I have an idea what we could do. We could... Uh, I would have to look. Okay, let me, let's get let's get back to base, and then we'll see, figure out. All right, okay, since we're back at base, uh, I want to look at all we have, because I don't exactly remember, it's been a while. So, I mean, conserves oxygen, we could get this, we could get the rebreather, to be honest. We could also get the mobile vehicle bay, but I'm not sure how you make a power cell. Do I even, oh, I have it. I need two batteries and silicone, which isn't that bad, to be honest. So I need a power cell lubricant, I know how to make that, and I know how to make the titanium ingot. I believe I all I know it maybe I'm not sure so that's actually pretty easy so I guess we can just make one part of it already I think never mind we're gonna have to do some <laughs> some limestone hunting which is going to be really fun because I really like doing that okay well give me a second Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. What are you doing down here? Ah! What are you doing down here? enough copper to make an extra battery for my sea glide and a power cell battery 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 okay we have a lot more than i thought how do you make power cell uh oh yeah silicone i don't have silicone where do you get silicone again i think it's by the uh, these things over here that's all i know here's some creep vine. okay we'll actually grab Grab a couple of each, just to see. I don't know how to make anything in that matter. Might as well make the fiber mesh because I'm gonna need it anyway. It's kind of convenient that I accidentally grabbed two because my game lagged, but you know, whatever. Why is it shaking so much? Uh... Okay, we have enough for power cells. Might as well cook the fish. And, okay, what else do we need? We need, I know, Power cell done, we need lubricant and a titanium ingot. How the 
I am just gonna. How do you make a titanium ingot? <sighs> titanium ingot. I need ten titanium. I am not that rich. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. This is why I always pick up anything in this game. And any survival games in that matter. I just pick up everything that I need or want. Uh, bro, he's trying to gas me. Or is he trying to gas those two? I have no idea. Lubricant. Lubricant. Okay. I'm just gonna make both. I don't know what else I need it for, but I'll just get it just in case. There we go. We have mobile thing. Mobile vehicle bay. This is taking a lot of power to make this. It's all worth it, though, I hope. Okay. Let's see what we can do with this. Oh, okay. We have to make this. Lead? I, where do you get lead? I've never seen lead before. We need another titanium ingot and a power cell. This is why I made a lot of batteries, okay? Okay, we are making the sea moth. We are ma we're getting the sea moth. <gasps> Power cell, easy. I know we need two glass, and I don't think I I don't think I have any resources in here. Yeah, I ba let's just say I'm basically broke, because I am, and might as well make a another battery. I need. Oh, it's the other way around. Uh <laughs> okay. Oh, well, let's not worry about it right now. Okay, so I need glass. Titanium ingot and uh, where do you get lead? I wonder if it's from the sandstone outcrops. <laughs> Biggest thing that I have trouble finding in this game is quartz, and I don't know why. How the fuck did I go this far? Quartz! Quartz! Yes! Yes! Oh my god, this is why you explore things. I don't know how much you need to make glass, but let's just say a lot. Oh no, it just powered off on me. Oh well, we have we have ingredients to make a uh, battery. Also, we have a radio message. This is Officer Keen in Light Pod 19. The captain is gone. I have assumed command. The last thing the captain did was give me coordinates for dry land. We regrouped one and a half kilometers southwest of the crash site. Stay together and good luck. This message will now repeat. Rendezvous coordinates corrupted. Transmission origin coordinates downloaded. Signal location uploaded to PDA. What do you mean there's a land? Uh, how do I do this? This is confusing as hell. Got it. Okay. Uh. Jeez, man. Okay. We have not enough. So we have two glass. Like we need, we need, all we need is a titanium ingot. We can make the, the vroom vroom. So let's go do that real quick. Let's look for, what did I need? Oh shit, what did I need? Why is my memory this bad? Oh my God, what? You expect me to go that deep? <laughs> I'm grabbing the vehicle. Let's do it. Oh, oh, look at it. It's so cute. It's so small. Yeah, look at it. Oh, look at it. Oh, it feels so good.
What is that crash over there? That seems all interesting. No, it's not. Okay, let's do this thing. I've been past. Oh my god, what is that? How did you get down here? How do I get down there? How do I get down there? Oh no, oh no. I don't like. What is that? There's so many things. Uh -huh. I have to find a way down. There's no way. What is that thing, though? Right there. What is that thing? Right there. What is it? I don't know. I'm scared. <sighs> okay. <sighs> Got it. Go, 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 go. Uh, I I have to go, like, deeper or something? Like, what is this? I, I don't feel safe. I don't feel safe. My uh, Ah. Uh. Is there just an easier route? Am I just taking, like, the most difficult? I'm looking for a safer route because I really don't feel safe anymore. Warning. I'm sorry, Susan! Oh my god, there's actually a straight shot down. Oh, that makes a lot more sense. Okay. Let's go down a little bit more. We'll stay at 98. NB. Okay, let's go down. We'll repair Susan, and then we'll go back up and leave. Because I hate this place, and I hate how deep we are. This is fucking nuts. Uh, okay. Oh my god. Okay. That took uh, fuck fuck some reason. Okay. High capacity. Oh, worth. Worth. I know, shut up. It's actually not too bad around here. I'm sorry, Susan. All right. Emergency. The quantum detonation has occurred in the No, I'm gonna miss it! The reactor will reach a supercritical state in T minus. I'm gonna miss it! Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Oh no! Oh shit! Oh, that could be the worst possible angle. Oh my god. Oh, that annoys me. Oh, I knew it. I knew as soon as I went out. If I wasn't such a little bitch, man. Oh, this one just can't read by itself. Okay. Life pod 19 second officer Kane's crew log to all... To all crew, if you're reading this, then you've been followed to the automatic distress signal broadcast by the life pod on board computer. That's crazy. Contrary to my orders, I've been forced to evac your orders and discard my safety to, att to attempt reach and discard of red rendezvous coordinates at the nearest land mace. I hope you see you there. Damn! I'm sorry, Susan. Ugh. This is Avery Quinn of Trading Ship Sunbeam. Aurora D. Reed, over. Nothing but vacuum. These Altera ships. They run low on engine grease, they send an SOS, you offer to help, they don't pick up. Aurora, I'm out on the far side of the system. It's gonna take more than a week to reach your position. Do you still need our assistance? Over. I'll try them again tomorrow. Damn Charter's gonna have us blowing our credits running errands for Altera. See what the long range stands pick up in the meantime. Couldn't understand a word you said back there, but Oh well. Oh woo! Have a cup of Whoa, what the fuck? This came out of nowhere. I mean I know I said dry lead, but like Oh, I should not have looked down. I should not have looked down. Oh my god. I can't look the back. What are those? Uh, it's breaking apart. What is it? Oh, it's still like a pool. Pool of water. Okay. I guess I could get out. I really don't want to. Oh my goodness. What are you talking about? What are you talking about? 
Oh my god, look how far away I am. That's fucking nuts. Look how small my life pod is compared to that ship. I mean, I know the ship's massive, but like, holy shit. Oh, wow, this island's pretty. What's that? Come on, guys. Let's go. Let's go exploring. I don't like how we're like, this is like such a thin area to walk on, but like, hey, whatever, man. Whatever floats my boat, right? It's just a water planet. What is that? Status rifle. Oh, that's a view. Well, since there's more here to eat, so I'll just grab some to replant it. Hey, Siri, stop talking. This is the first time I've seen sunlight in months. After all that time in the deep, I've been dreaming of it. Now that I'm back here, oh, fuck. I'm finding it hard to enjoy alone. Father was right. We should never have left this place. We shouldn't have gone so deep. They do not want us down there. Despite my best efforts, ill health is taking hold of me. The visions are getting worse. Marguerite and Father are now part of the ecosystem of this incredible planet. It's reassuring to know that when I go, I'll join them. Until then, well, there's always the view. All right. Oh, Krabby! What the fuck are you? Oh, where's my knife? Oh, I'm panicking. <gasps> what are you? I don't know. Is it like a gun? I mean, it has rifle in its name, so I assume so. More status rifle. I hear more. I hear more clicking. I can't get in there. There's a purple thing in there. How do we get in? I want in. I want in these. Now, ultra glide. There's more of those things down there. Chief's log, five weeks since the crash. The only other survivors are my son Bart and Mida, the cut price mercenary I commissioned for the journey. After days drifting in the life pod, rain hammering on the roof, the weather cleared and we washed up here. I had Mida salvage the Degazi wreck. Set Bart to finding us a stable source of food. His education is paying off sooner than I'd anticipated. Our only problem is Maida. She says the weather's going to turn. I say she's finding excuses to risk our lives. I imagine she's not going to weaken her life without a physical altercation, and she's itching for a fight. In every judgment she makes, things go from bad to worse. If she had my experience, she'd have more faith. Humans have spent millennia specializing in how to shackle nature to our will. This planet won't cause us any new problems. My one task now is to keep us alive as comfortably as possible until the insurance company arranges rescue. In this part of space, that could be months or even years. Wow, okay, okay. The story is unfolving. Son, I said wait for the storm to pass. Your life's more valuable to me than a plant patch. You stopped being in charge when the ship you were captaining sunk. I'll stop being in charge when you take charge of yourself. Say, Chief. Chief! What? You know how to drain those grow beds of 40 tons of storm water? Or how to conjure food from the air? I know how to prioritize. I'm just saying, if that's so, what's your boy's life worth to you today? If tomorrow you're gonna be so hungry you start wondering what he tastes like, let him go deal with the plants. Son, go deal with the plants. Bart, Torgo has visited the Bart's the habitat. 
interfere with my family again, and when rescue arrives, I will leave you here. Do you understand me? No rescue coming, Chief. Not in time. No staying here, neither. This rain keeps falling, sooner or later this place will be buried. The only choice we got is whether to get buried with it. Jeez, the lore in this game. All right, last one. This island is a godsend. Look out of the window. No predators. Fresh food. No building materials. Nothing left of the ship. And your kid says we're gonna starve without more grow beds. Speak up, kid. It's true, father. The natural growth rates are too slow to keep supporting us. All I'm saying is oceans got us surrounded. No use hiding. Sooner or later, we'll get our feet wet. The rest of your life may have been a fight made up, but I've made my decision. You want to forfeit your emergency pay to take a swim? Go ahead. Believe me, I'm thinking on it. Alright, alright, so we got a bunch of lore there. Jesus Christ. Okay, it's getting morning. I don't have to use this goddamn thing anymore. Um... Yeah, that's nuts. So, okay, so we got a lot of stuff there. We got a lot of indoor grow beds. That, oh my god! Uploaded. Okay, okay, so I think we've done enough for today. We actually got a lot done. We got Sally the Sea Moth. The fuck was that? Anywho. So we got Sally the Sea Moth. We got this thing. We got plenty of food. We got a lot of things done. We got a lot of coordinates and everything. I said it was successful. And tomorrow I plan on getting the radiation suit, uh, the habitat builder, and some other stuff that comes along the way. Also exploring the... Not that. There was something else. That thing. We'll be exploring that. So if you guys did enjoy, subscribe, like, all that fun stuff, and I'll catch you all later. Peace.